And, uh, hit me up, call in, whatever you want to do. Because these old school games, uh, can't, like, play other people and stuff. You can call in 513-81799. play this why should I get Ziggy in the studio call in. Hard for me to read the chat and uh, play. That's the music I hear right before I answer the calls. <laughs> Yes, I'm taking calls. 513-813-7979. Yeah. Do 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 Man, I thought I had a sad life on a Saturday afternoon. You do, still. You're I know, that's why I called you. Yeah, you're sitting here watching. No, I'm watching football. No, you're watching. I... No, bullshit, fuck off. 
I'm you, watching North Carolina State and Clemson. No, you're watching me play because I'm the shit. Listen, I went to the top of Pike's Peak yesterday. Wow. Off in the distance, I could see your frosted tips hair. I don't have frosted tips. That was 50 I know, it's plus you... years ago. You, you Philly slash Jersey people need to fucking let it go. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, uh, I wanted to give you an update on uh, my uh, dating uh, thing. Yeah, now, now uh, Jim the Regular did time in jail for robbing two banks. So, and you killed a roommate at one time, too. Um, Alleged, allegedly. Are you going to, uh, uh, like, you're on a dating app and stuff. Is that your new way of hunting down victims? Well, you know, it's legal stalking. <laughs> Why would you want to get, you've been married a hundred times. Why do you want to do that? Oh, I'm not getting married. That's no, what, no, no, no. If, if she... <laughs> If she says it's time to get married, some woman you meet online, you're going to get married. Uh, I'm going to do the old uh, David Spade, uh, bye bye Yeah? Okay. Yeah. No, I don't need that aggravation. But there's no, listen, there's no fresh banks out there in uh, Colorado? <laughs> yeah, but they're, they're getting hit left and right. I'm staying the hell out of it. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> every every other day there's some bank get robbed so, and i always raise my hand like yeah say, i'm here you're you're a consultant for them right like you can help them <laughs> <laughs> yeah here's here's what i'd say don't do it yeah. <laughs> Just don't. it so, ain't worth it so did you meet a girl online yeah and uh within uh about three weeks uh She's starting to try to pawn things off to me. Like, you know, can you watch this kid? Can you watch this? Then the other day she calls me and says, oh, I just got a DUI. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. I said, <laughs> what? And then talking to her later, she goes, yeah, well, I have arthritis. And that's how I uh, controlled the pain. <laughs> By drinking? What a dumb bitch! Are you, did, Jesus! Did Christ. you have? Did you? Did you have sex with her already? Oh no, no! And thank God. Why? Uh, I don't be, know. You got to do it. What? I understand, but that that scares me. I don't know. You know, when you when you're that when you're more fucked up than me, that scares me. <laughs> How old are her kids? Oh no! Oh, this story is unbelievable. She's <laughs> she now has guardianship over her two year old grandson. Uh oh. Because because her son is a drug addict. Perfect. <laughs> Does it get any better? Yeah. Come on. So so yeah. so instant family, just add Jim the regular. <laughs> 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 yeah, I, I'm. I'm just doing this just to you know get the stories, and plus I know I'm being the n a number of women are on there just scamming people. They're yeah, just scamming. Oh yeah, you know they're they're it's screwed up. But anyway, I just wanted to give you an update on my uh, tremendously successful love life. I love it. I think it's cool. It's kind of fun to isn't it kind of fun to start over. Oh, yeah, it is, but then you walk in the... I, all of a sudden, I'm going... I miss the old days of, you know, picking up some drunk bitch. At least they were more normal. Well, this is a drunk bitch. You just said it. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> right. Oh, but her one, rede her one redeeming quality? Yes. I don't drive and drink when I have kids in the car. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's only when the kids aren't in the car and I go out and, and try to kill others. <laughs> That's it exactly. Did you have to bail her out? Hey, well, no, no, no. Uh -oh. I, 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 I think her, her daughter did. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. even worse. I know. I know. Out in that, out here in Colorado, they're 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 pretty tough on uh, DUI. Right. Well, uh, because oh yeah, because they're like, well, why do you have to do that when we gave you pot? Yeah, you got pot. Yeah. You know and. And it's wide open spaces. You got to drive somewhere. I mean, yeah, right. Jesus. 
<laughs> so, yeah. hey, you survive. Well, yeah. anyway, I just wanted to check in with you and let you know that uh, I'll check in every once in a while. I'll give you an update. I'm going to try to hook up with a even more a sadder case than this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to hear these stories. <laughs> Later. See ya. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. 513-813-7979. That's the uh, phone number. Um, It's easier to take phone calls and shit while I'm doing this rather than... Uh, I can't read the... Um, the talk, the chat room here, the text while I'm playing because it's hard, so it's easier to uh, take calls. And plus, I mean, not everybody is sitting there reading the chat, you know? I don't even think you can really see it that well on this uh, gaming thing. Um, so it's kind of dumb to sit here and just answer shit one sided. Better when there's phone calls so you can hear a conversation. While I play, and these old school games, you can't play with somebody else, so it's not like we can talk on there. Super Mario's a shit. I kind of disagree with Jim the regular, where he doesn't want to get hooked up with uh, some some of these chicks that are. Uh, I mean, that's what you're going to run into on uh, these dating apps are chicks that are kind of, you know, got emotional issues and stuff. And that's what you're on there for, right? They want to be, uh, they're on there to use somebody. Why can't you? Right? And they're grown adults. He doesn't want to marry these girls, so have some fun, right? Fuck it. And a phone number is there. You decide to call. I'm done playing all this shit. I'll bounce off. Unless the calls keep going and all that. I was... No one's home, so I figured I'd jump down and start playing some games. I haven't done it in a while. I'm like, oh fuck, I'll just throw the stream on. See what's happening on a uh, Saturday afternoon. Here we go. This is way easier to play with a joystick. I'm ordering a joystick. Fuck this handheld one with the fuck.
513-813-7979. It's a phone number. It doesn't say it on here. I'm sorry. But that's what you do. We're on all of them today. Facebook. Uh, for some reason, the Twitter one's not working anymore. But Facebook. Uh, both Facebooks. EBN and uh, mine. And on uh, Twitch. YouTube. All that shit. I don't turn on the uh, EBN one that much at all. Especially for Club Chris. People get mad that I'm not on there playing fucking music and uh, and uh, giving away tickets on Facebook Live. That's what e- all EBN is for, I guess, is for tickets and Metallica. <laughs> this bullshit. You guys need to play more Metallica on the Facebook. Eat a dick. Country Jeff. Yeah, what's up, Mike? What's up, Mike? I just sitting here watching the football game. Yeah, that's what seems to be what everybody's doing. I'm just playing video games. What video game are you playing? Well, it's Pac-Man right now. Oh. I thought you I thought you were talking about I've been wanting to play that new Mortal Kombat. I ain't played that. Jeff, are you drunk yet? No, I'm, I'm doing laundry. I'm drinking, but I ain't drunk. Hey, Jeff, uh, when was the last time you got laid? It's been a while. It's been about, uh, it ain't been a while. It's been about three or four months. No, that's since we heard about it. it who was the girl? Did some trick of the night. <laughs> trick of the night? <laughs> Damn. How much did it cost? Dash. Uh, I think she just wanted to get high. It was only about 25 bucks. And you I got, let her get high first. And you, got, you got to do it with her the whole, like, all the way? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I strapped on my Jimmy. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. No, I know, but you got to do everything with her? Yeah. Now, how come you don't videotape that and put it up on uh, your Twitter account? Because they'll, they'll kick me off the of Twitter. I no. videotape something like that and put it on there. No, you could do you could do sex stuff on Twitter. I didn't know you could. I know that there's something on the Twitter or whatever. I've looked at it because I was wondering how these girls kept getting my information. And uh, and uh, they was uh, saying they, they got something called, uh, I don't know what it is. It's on Twitter. They'll put their things out there, but it's called, you got to, like, so in order to talk with them, you got to talk with them online. Yeah. Well, the, well and no, you, you got to pay for it. Yeah, don't fuck with that, but the nudity you could have and stuff on there, so you could do that shit. 
I didn't know because I cussed one guy out because he was talking shit well, about that guy. Well, no, you can't. You can't. Like you can't curse people out and all that stuff because then somebody will turn you in or something. You know. But you can have nudity on there. Yeah, I just know. That'd be pretty big for you if you uh, <laughs> if you <laughs> got with some hooker and put it on your Twitter. <laughs> hey, loan me the money. Yeah, I will. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Yeah, I put it on there. I don't care. I know. I know two ton Tammy. She lives on the third floor. She's big, big girl. Yeah, that's why they call her two ton. What, what's her deal though? Why? Why is she? Uh, is she easy to get? What's? I mean, what is it? No, I could probably get her. I could probably buy her a fucking meatball sandwich from uh, from Kroger's or something. Mm. I'd probably get that. No, I don't want that. That's too much loading for me. Yeah. Yeah, you know, they call her two thumb because she's really big. She looks about she weighs probably about four hundred pounds. And that stops you? Yeah, yeah. That's the, I don't want to get crushed in the process. <laughs> that that shit never stopped me. <laughs> shit. Yeah. You know, if you'd seen her, I think you'd probably become celibate. <laughs> I already have. Yeah, so but yeah, you got it. I said your wife. Your wife ain't bad looking. No, I never. Yeah, she's pretty good looking. She doesn't want to do anything with me. No, well, just uh, smoke some weed with her. That well, helps too. I, I, I want to do stuff with you, Jeff. You ain't doing nothing with me. Why not? I don't fly that way. Come on, just two bros. Why don't you ask my? I got my 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 uh, aunt. She's on my phone thing. She just followed me. She said that she wants to meet you. Okay. Well, your mom, your, mom, your mom is on my Facebook. She's really hot. Yeah, she said she don't like you because when I was a nice to you or whatever, that y'all didn't seem to care. I don't know she about She said you're the devil. Yeah, your mom seems to be very religious. Yeah, I don't know. She used to not be that way, but she is now. Well, she's religious because when I see those pictures of her, she's got a big chest, and I'm like... God damn. Yeah, some guy paid 10 grand for them things. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, some guy, he said the house foot and everything. I don't know what happened to him now. Would it be crazy if you found out, like, like maybe your mom killed her? Killed him? Uh, nah, she didn't do nothing like that. No, I know, but I'm just saying. Wouldn't it be crazy? If he was... got heavy in the coke, and she just quit talking to him. Yeah. That happens. And then she, I don't know, somehow she found God or something. Your mom doesn't look that much older than you. Yeah, I, did. I probably look, but hell, I probably look older than she does. Yeah. How old was she when she had you? I honestly don't know. I'm 32. I don't know. Each time I ask her how old she is, she always gets mad at me, so I never ask her how old she is. I don't know. She's probably about 50 or something. Uh, I don't know. He looks I'm younger 32, than that. so that'd be about what 18, I guess. He looks younger than 50. Well, I'm saying though, I'm 32. I know I wasn't adopted. You think she'll kiss me? No, I doubt it, man. She's pretty pissed off. Oh, uh, last time, uh, last time when I was on the show, she said, "How can you give that Johnny Five his own show? And you can't give me mine when I've been with you guys since years, and years, and years, and years." Well, know, I could, I ago. well, we, we knew Johnny Five a lot longer than you, but we could, we could get you. you get. Yeah, Johnny was on our show since almost day not one. here in Cincinnati. Yeah, not here in Cincinnati. I've been, I've been here way longer than that. No, Johnny. I've been doing this since I've lived in Norwood. No, I know, but we knew Johnny. He was the first person that reached out to us when we were brand new. Yeah, well, I'm still trying to reach out. Is there any shows going on here in Bogart here soon? Uh, on the 30th of October. Who's playing? Uh, Black Label Society. Are y'all going to be down there for that one like y'all was down for the tool one? Yeah. Yeah, I'll be down there. Yeah. 
Yeah, I got a. Uh, I, I don't know why, man. You didn't let me come on stage at that fireworks station. Where that fireworks thing y'all had? I was willing to come up on stage unless you're that scared of COVID. I ain't got COVID. I've had all my vaccines. Oh, yeah. Oh, you were willing to come up? Yeah, I was willing to come up. What did you think? I was just sitting there, staring from a shadow for uh, hours. Well, uh, yeah. I didn't stand there for hours, but they wouldn't let me bring the alcohol in my book bag, so I had my book bag hid outside. You can't, you, well, no one was allowed up on that stage, so. No, well, okay, well, I don't know how rock and roll you guys supposedly are, but, you know, you know I know you guys had that song, or that, that group called Beat Off for a while. I know Thomas quit. I yeah. figured that would help out with that or something, sing the song, but they probably wouldn't allow it there. It's the family environment. Hey, Jeff, remember when he came into the studio and he showed everybody your dick? Uh, uh, Van Axton, Wild Turkey, had me out my mind. I have a tape of you when, like, I think it was your uncle called in and you screamed at him and told him that he threw you in jail for 52 days. Uh, was it the time when I got charged with aggravated menacing? It probably I was. I don't know. But he called in and you fought with him. I'm probably fixing back to go back to jail. For real, I'm supposed to. I, what's when I got out of that rehab? I was supposed to do something called IOP. I ain't been doing that. You got to go there three days a week, three hours a day. That's like working at the Kid Chris show. So you're not going to do it? I ain't been doing it. I've been supposed to do it since I've been out. I don't know whatever she says That's when I go on the fourth to go see my probation officer. Are you uh, still wearing, are you wearing your country Jeff shirt right now? I ain't wearing it right now. I got it in Washington. How many do you have left? I only got two. You only gave me two. Oh, okay. So, good. Just but, don't put it on hot uh, water. Put it on cold water. Yeah, put it on cold water. It'll so, last longer. Yep, and it won't fade. Right. Hey, Jeff. I do, I do need some help, though. Jeff, when you're out there in the... Um, out there in the wilderness, you know, on the streets. Keep an eye out for that Brian Laundry guy, the guy who killed that Gabby girl. Oh, yeah. You know what? That son of a gun. Oh, I think he, honestly, I think he probably went off in the woods somewhere and off himself. Maybe. I don't, because they, they would have done found him by now. And then I heard about, and I got kind of got pissed off about the news. They said something about... You know, like, they're looking so hard for this girl because she's got blonde hair and blue eyes, and, uh, and she's white, and, you know, and our kids are missing, blah, 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 you know, whatever, children, whatever, you know, uh, 20-year-olds or whatever are missing, and you ain't looking for them because they're minorities. I think that's a bunch of junk because, you know what, I mean, all you can do is help find one person at a time. You know, don't blame it on race. Don't blame. It. I get so tired of hearing about race. I live down in the down in the ghetto. I'm a minority down here. You don't hear me complaining. What are you talking about? That's all you do is complain. No, I don't complain. I just kind of, I just kind of get pissed off about about certain views. That's why WLW doesn't you know, listen to me. No, no, I got, I get pissed off about my views. I get certain views about certain things. You know. You know, it's like, well, shit, you know, hell, you know, if I was, if I was, you know, you know, I'm going to start, I've been, and that's really what pisses off some cops sometimes. I'd be like, damn, I guarantee you if I was white, this wouldn't happen to me. Where they want me to dump out half my ice house head beer or whatever else. I, I, I pull that card on them and that fucks them up. And they're just like, go on, go on, go on. Is I filed and and I know this. Uh, that's why I wanted to talk to that sort W Pimrose guy. I want to get uh, racial discrimination against the Cincinnati Police Department. Jeff, but oh well, it is what it is. Jeff, my time has come. Well, I hope you do good. Hopefully, you buy something more than better than an Atari next video game system you have. Get you get you something and play Halo or something. Nah, that's cool. Jeff, what what are the magic words at the end of the phone call? Uh, get drunk, man. Keep on keeping on. Close enough. So long for now.